ハトが三百万。Hey there, my name is Duck, and welcome to my floor. And today is my April store and organizing fire cards video. I'm so sorry that this is a little bit late by like when I try and usually get these videos up, but I've just not had the energy recently. Um, a lot's been going on, and I'll explain as we go through. But let's just get straight into it we have like a lot to put away today um considering it's a lot of on and off it's a lot of way i um like a really decent chunk of aimers and then just some other little bits so as usual we will go from least to most binder wise and i think today we're actually starting with unflying which is crazy so let's go okay we only have this one sun cube fair card to put away today it's from his guardian bear um what's it called his guardian bear keychain release um man's got more merch which i appreciate it's so cute um all of these photo cards that you are seeing actually um were in a massive um <laughs> collective haul sorry there we go they were in a massive collective haul that like i tried to export about genuinely about 20 times over like a three-day period and nothing i was doing was making it export like it would get to like the 40 50 percent mark and then just be like one of your files was corrupted but each time it would be like a different file that corrupted or whatever so i had to give up on that and that was like one of the reasons why this took so long for me to film because i was like trying to get that video up and out before this one and it just wasn't working so yeah sorry that all these photo cards are like basically like new and you've not seen them before they were in a collective hall that just refused to fucking work and it stressed me out so bad i had to have a couple days to just like de-anger myself at my video editing software to be able to like do stuff so that is literally it for end flying um now we can move on to lucy once again we only have the one photo card for lucy we have one of sangyo uh fever photo cards just here so here we go it's so cute also if you hear any um noises or whatever like scotland's running like running around oh do you know when like your hands are like a little bit clammy so then like sleeves won't we'll sort of wrap it up yeah when you show it properly because it's so cute because of the lack of um what's it called um collective hall i'll try and like show all the photo cards as best as i can um but yeah if you hear any scuttlings it's because um we got two new kittens um one of the reasons i have not had energy is <laughs> because well i'm not sure if i so you can hear one of them scuttle them around um i'm not sure if i spoke about it or if i did i just mentioned it in passing um eight weeks ago we actually had to put my 22 year old cat down um we had to put kitty down she was the one you used to be able to you used to be able to hear just yelling all the time um old age just got to her like she, 22 is a big age for a cat um so we had to put her down and then like that was sort of expected because you know she was old and like stuff had been happening with her um but then unexpectedly about it'll be about three weeks ago now we had to put our other older cat down tj um and that was like really unexpected um and that really like took it out of me like one of the reasons we got the kittens was because he was lonely um because he went from in the span of like two three years he went from being like one out of four cats to being on his own and he's like never been on his own so like one of the reasons obviously like we got the kittens was for me because um like two three years ago we had to put two of our other old cats down the problem with getting cats at the same time is that they all get old at the same time um but yeah we um he went from being like and they were my cats they like i was their human they chose me and then we went to two cats um who i wasn't their human obviously they loved me and i love them but they weren't like they hadn't picked me so i sort of um had a little bit of a 
time not having a cat that like was mine um so that was part of the reason we got these two new kittens that uh, we rescued them um but another another reason was for tj because he was lonely and he was grieving and that bugger <laughs> popped his clogs like a few days after we got the kittens so we got them partially for him and he's not even grateful he wasn't even grateful um if i don't joke about it i will cry um because it was really unexpected we thought we'd have him for a good few more years because he wasn't like he was old for a cat but he wasn't like kitty old so we just sort of forgot the usual lifespan of cats um, so we thought we'd have a few more years with him, but unfortunately not. But that is one of the reasons why I've not had any energy. I've been grieving. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, but a good, a good like, aside from that energy drain, um, we have, like, a happy energy drain because we have the kittens and they've been keeping me on my toes. And I love them so, so much. And they've really been, like, a balm to my soul and helping me like cope and grieve and stuff but if you hear any scuttling or you see just like something like dart across um i have two new kittens their names are basil and tilly um i'll put up pictures here because they're so cute um i love them to pieces they have chosen me uh i am their human and i could not be more thankful um but yeah uh they're my little best friends and you'll probably see them at some point but for now, I think you'll just hear them because uh, Tilly is currently fast asleep on my bed. But I have more cats to never shut up about. So I'm so sorry that if they're all I talk about. <laughs> so that is it for Lucy. We only have like two more left for Haze, which is really good. Uh, I'm, ign I'm ignoring Boogeyman. That like, it stresses me. Boogeyman is like stressing me out. Um, I always seem to only ever have like two left. And why is it always one Gwangil and one Yechan? Like, what is it? What is, what is that about? So let's move on to my semi alt binder. So for the semi alt binder, we only have one uh, Monster X photo card to put away. We have a Kian photo card. Because now I'm only, sorry, one there you go. I'm like, I only need one more album now and then I've like fully completed my Monster X backlog collecting, which is so fun. Like, I'm really happy about that. So we have, that's why it's, oops, sorry. So we have the, ow, oh my goodness, that was like, like a plastic cut um, instead of a paper cut. But we have this Kian from The Clown Part 2. I think this was the innocent version, but this is absolutely stunning. Like I'm, um, <laughs> like we got we got Pinkian, and that's very exciting. Now I only need the I I only need one more photo card, and then I'm complete with backlog for how I'm collecting them, which is so good. Um, every time I go to this collection, I'm like, oh, what if, what if, what if, and have things. But um, from here on out, my videos will be a bit more sporadic as I've. <sighs> I've come up against some like financial concerns, not not actually, not actually, um, but I've sort of reevaluated like where my money's going and stuff, um, like where my disposable income is going. Um, and this year I'm focusing on experiences. And so like I'm going to a concert at the end of June in Berlin. Um, and then like in September, I'm doing like a mini Europe tour with my bestie. Um, to go see like W24 for a few shows and then like next year I want to go back to Korea with that friend and like literally tomorrow I'm going to see Starkid in London with my best friends so like I really want to focus on experiences and I can't be focusing on experiences if I'm focused on like deep deep collecting like I have been doing so we'll see uh, like a lot has changed I say a lot little things have changed in my collection um and the way I'm sort of like thinking about things has changed but I'll explain more to that when we get to it because you'll see you'll see in like literally the next binder so let's move on to the next binder which is my just my other groups binder so for my other groups binder we have like a decent amount to put away however this is the binder where so much has changed as you can see b2b is 
so much smaller and um, I actually decided that for like backlog collecting albums if I'm not searching out those albums to listen to I'm not going to backlog collect them and you'll see it in a second as well I was not doing that for B2B um I am heavily invested in new things that they put out but I wasn't searching out their older albums past the ones I've already got so condensed and um, we actually have uh some chicks uh the young man and the deep sea photo cards these two are album cards and then this um I got when I bought these is actually from his exhibition um which I wanted to go see while I was in um Korea but they like changed the dates and stuff so it wasn't on while I was there but we have mullet hyunchik which obviously is the dream so he goes in the middle and then we have these two album cards which are so cute i think we got like every concept from the mv this way which is so fun um but yeah if i'm not actively searching the albums that i don't have out then i can't like want them that much you know what i mean um i've had to be like really tough on myself uh, now we move on to a new collection i set up for this i didn't like i set up for this and another collection just off camera um because like i said i'm like energy wise i'm not doing super good um and it was just easier to do it off camera um but we have chew now this is going to be like much like my yenna collection it's going to be chill as hell um i'm just keeping pulls but yeah i think this one can go in the middle they're so cute um and like i said no energy i haven't decorated this or anything but i just needed something to show off that this was our collection so that one can go in the middle because it's cute and this is also cute but i like the like sort of gingery in this one so yes new collection there is another new collection in here but it's not um <laughs> it's not big none of neither of these collections are big collections but there we go so that is my shoe collection very cute very cute basil she's around somewhere they're six months old so they are just four minute rounds uh, then we can skip over kingdom uh kingdom i've i have pre-ordered their latest album uh, that's on the way oh well it will be when it's released which i think it, sh it should be by now yeah i've listened to it so i don't know why the company i bought from is taking the time but it'll be on the way to me eventually um yeah we are actually going all the way to the back to my miscellaneous pc section and this is where <laughs> things have changed a lot because you may have noticed stray kids no longer has a section in this binder so here we go i've left a bit of um space so i have moved zodiac as well to the back here because um I am no longer collecting for Zodiac. Um, I just, like I said, I'm not like, I don't listen to like their first album at all. And I only like very rarely listen to their like two single albums that they've put out. I have to be in like such a very like specific mood. And I just wasn't really keeping up with this, com like this latest comeback at all. I wasn't like searching things out where why did i only what is happening wait did i not set up for this correctly okie dokie right i haven't set up for this correctly <laughs> i did do this at midnight but uh what i will do is just put these on the back here because i cannot be bothered so we have another davin like i still think they're like lovely and like sweethearts and stuff but i just i'm not like, I can't justify collecting a group where the music isn't the priority. Do you know what I mean? Like, I just, I can't justify that. So, there we go. Um, and as you can see, BXB is also here. Um, I'll still be, like, supporting these groups digitally. Because um, I, like, I probably will, like, go back and listen to, like, Zodiac stuff. Or I'll, like, you know, if they release something new, I'll probably do it digitally. But I just can't support them monetarily anymore same with bxb um i love bxb but i cannot justify 
like trying to find these like backlog albums and whatever for it so yeah bxb are also here uh qwer is also here because this is a bit different um they their oldest member um like a clip resurfaced for them um where she was very um for like uh chodan she was very anti-feminist and as someone who for the past like over a decade has had feminist killjoy scrawled somewhere on my person like i like i can't morally continue to support a group which has like a very anti-feminist member in it because i'm such a feminist so they have been moved um there's actually i'm really upset because i actually like bought both copies of their latest album because it's really good at manito but i just yeah i'm gonna keep what i have but i won't be supporting them going forward and i've just put their photo cards here and then <sighs> my bank account collection i was so excited for this um i was so excited for this collection like I was ready, I like I had so much fun setting up for it and I was so excited because I really do love Stray Kids but I cannot afford to back collect them at all. They just have too many albums and it would take me too long um, and also I am um, like there are a few of the albums I'm searching out like in my spare time um like Maxident um Christmas Evil I like I know that's a Christmas album but I like I search that out a lot um but I I just can't afford it and I especially can't afford to collect a member in full um because I was like, oh, you know, like the album, like the album photo cards are so cheap. It doesn't matter if they're so cheap, that adds up. Um, and while I love Bang Chan and I love the kids, I I can't justify it. Um, so this will change in the future. Like when I am more settled in like where I want to put my money. Um, because at the minute I'm having like, I'm having like a resurgence of hobbies like i'm back in my knitting and crocheting game um i'm back reading um and then i also need money to go towards experiences and i just can't afford to back collect an album and net, like back collect a group with like a specific member for like all the photo cards so for now my stray kids collection is just going here um we'll see what happens going forward i probably when i get myself a bit more settled i'll probably like reset up the collection but it will just be like a very few specific albums and i'll just keep polls um for whatever album it is like it'll just be like one version of the album and i'll just keep polls um but yeah it's genuinely like upsetting me that i've had to do this but i had to do it somewhere so yeah that's it's a little bit sad but i'm glad i at least have like one era of his complete um so it's not going anywhere it's like it'll probably be a few months and i'll probably like reset up for stuff but just for now everything has been moved and then i don't have to worry about it um because i don't think you should be worrying about a collection i think if something stresses you out you move it or you get rid of it or whatever like collecting should be fun and right now my priorities money-wise have just changed and that's perfectly fine like that's a-okay <laughs> so that is it for this binder we can now move on to the k-bands binder so for k-bands we have a decent amount and we have a new collection in here as well and i bet you're like duck why what you've literally just said you've had to like think about money and you like just like stop your straight kids collection blah 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 um this collection is going to be so much easier than what the straight kids um collection would be um and also i 
I have so much more leniency in my heart for bands. Um, they are where I thrive. Um, and they are where I get all of my inspiration and my healing. Um, and day six are no exception, especially with their new albums. On also, this is all it's this is all the setup. And all of these are pulls. None of these are like specific member, they're just album pulls. Uh, and also I have a few of them. So like this is gonna be a cheap collection and it's gonna be one and done. I think there are only a few albums after this that I need to get, so that's fine. Um so all of this is day six as you can see so we have um this is gravity and then i think this is these two are i don't know i know what these are <laughs> uh, i think it's gravity and then negentropy that i have yes yes it is so put these to the side for the minute so yeah so these are uh these will be Gravity and then these will be Negentropy. So, uh, Gravity is my, oh well, The Book of Us Gravity is my favourite um, Day6 album. So, it had to be like, well, technically the second one I got because I bought um, Forever. Yeah, um, Day6 have offered me a lot of healing recently. Um, you know, it's just everything that's been going on, and I'm very grateful for that. Um, especially just where I am at the minute, because I <laughs> I don't really want to go into it a lot, but I've just been feeling quite um, listless. I've been sort of feeling like things just aren't like I'm not doing enough just in life, um, but. I am doing enough in life, I'm doing all, like as much as I can, and that's okay. Um, and day six have been very helpful in making me realise that. Um, <laughs> so yeah, uh, then so we have Gravity and Negentropy, and then we also have two of those out of the blue photo cards, because I found these for so cheap, I cannot find the album anywhere for the fucking life of me. But found these photo cards so <laughs> i will forever be on the lookout for his i'm sorry that's not that's crooked for the album but these two photo cards i will happily accept so where is did i am i just a fucking idiot did i not sell up for forever i didn't what in the world okay uh, this one is very cute this one's very cute um but for forever we pulled these so we got three out of the three out of four members i am one pill biased however i love them all so dearly that it sort of doesn't matter <laughs> uh, am i putting okay i'm putting uni unit cards after but yeah um i love them all so dearly it really doesn't matter who i pull but i am one pill biased so there we go see like i really don't i don't need a lot for them and yeah yeah uh then we can move on to soran which is actually quite unexpected um because i didn't think their latest album came with a photo card but it does which is so exciting um so here we have uh you will. I was gonna like do this as an unboxing, but I just I couldn't. I just didn't have the energy. But we pulled you will. This is one of like the nicest photo cards I've ever seen in my life. Like, look how sparkly shiny, and then it's like so thick. It's great. I love it. So here we go. There we are. So that is it for K bands. Also, go check out Soran's latest album. It's called uh, Setlist. It is absolutely brilliant. It's wonderful. So, yes, and now we can move on to the bulk. <laughs> the bulk of this video, which is my alt binder. So, 
let's go into that. Okay, we have so much to put away in here, um, starting with Amos. We have, oh my goodness, we have all of these to put away. Um, and some, where is, where is that fur card gone? Hold on just a second. Here we go. Okay, so we are actually completing some eras today, which is very exciting. We are completing fireworks finally, which is so fun. So here we go. This is so good. This was actually um, a trade, I think, or like someone sold it to me on Instagram, but we are finally, finally finished with fireworks, which is so exciting. And then we are actually like complete with um, their latest album, which is Somebody. So one, two, one, two, three, four. So yeah, completely caught up with Somebody, which is so exciting. Um, let's see. Oh my gosh. These sleeves are so slippy. So let's figure out how I want to sort this out. So I think if we just put the concept here, the concept was part of these here. Um, like I did with fireworks, I like to sp split out the concept from the rest of them and to put them with some kinds of other photo cards. And then, oh my gosh, so it's, I think maybe the red should go in the middle. I think, I think that looks cute. I think that looks nice, I think that looks nice. So yeah, these are stunning. I'm so glad I like pulled him twice <laughs> and then just had to trade for this one, which was so nice. And this is from the Nemo version. But yeah, so that is it for this. And then we can put these away. Um, so, right, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven pattern. So here we have two group cards. Uh, these all came in the Nemo version. So I'm going to put one on either end. So like here and then... here but yeah these guys are so busy in japan at the moment i'm so proud of them and then from here we can just put them in um age order so go goodness it's because it's like slowly like it's starting to get warmer so Hands are a little clammy. Yeah. So they finally started putting like English subtitles on their content again, which is so exciting. Like I'm so happy. Uh, really nice. These ones are really nice quality. Like I don't know why the Nemo version photo cards are nicer quality than the album photo cards, but I'll take it. So yeah, that is it for somebody. And then we just have two like extra um, photo cards. We have this music art Dorian uh, cheek pinch that I got because I entered a fan sign. Uh, didn't get it, that's fine. Uh, and then we also have this Soundwave. Um... Is it Soundwave? Sorry, Mwave um, group photo card because I did buy a signed copy of the album. Um, if anyone has any like tips on how to wrap that, please let me know. Um, it's currently just sort of like on my shelf. So yeah, if anyone has any tips or tricks on how to wrap signed albums, please let me know. Um, but I got like a full grouped signed from M-Wave. So that is it for Amos. I'm so happy. Like we literally just need like some photo cards from the first album and then we're like caught up which is so exciting like i'm so glad we got to like complete amos complete amos complete somebody like 
in the like during the era that is so good um so now we can move on to on and off so i have so much to put away for on and off um it's a lot so let's just let's just let's just sort this out let's just sort this out uh we're just gonna ignore these two for now don't look at me don't look at me <laughs> most of this is wyatt uh, the majority is Wyatt, because of course. So we have his um, on off album photo card. I still don't have this album, but I have his photo card. Um, I'm hoping I can just like find someone selling the album without a photo card for cheap, which is sort of that's the goal. Um, so, oh my gosh, that's sort of mm, okay. I might have to maybe like put something in here to stop it from bending a bit on the corner. I think that's just because there's no other photo cards in it, but we'll see. A bit worrying that. Um, then we can move on to uh, where is it? City of On and Off because we have all of his City of On and Off photo cards. We have all six so we have the blue and the pink i think we'll do the blue first but yeah i have really um attached myself to on and off these past couple months like they are like the current hyperfixation group <laughs> um and i'm like not i'm really not mad about it so we have these Three. Can back just like that. Sorry, we'll do pink first. Uh, I think we'll put that one in the middle because he's doing like a little like thumbs up, and then these are like peace signs. That makes sense. Um, yeah, I've like really attached myself to these guys this era. Um, they're currently having like they've just finished up their spotlight um shows in japan so they're having a little break which is very nice like i'm they're thriving right now and i'm so happy um and they get to have like a break after which is so nice and then we have these i think like this because then these two are tilted and this one sort of like is less tilted does that make sense yeah but yeah i love them Ooh. Then we can move on to the, well let's just see because one of my like goals this year was to have at least one of his eras completed and we've done that. We've absolutely done that so that is very very exciting. Uh, then we can move on to the latest release which is Beautiful Shadow because we have just a few um and they're mostly Asian. um <laughs> they are literally all Asian. so we have one of his digi packs and one of his gray version so let's go um this is so cute this is so stinking like this is one of his best photo cards ever it's one of his best photo cards ever so here we go uh, then we can move on to the digipacks. Yeah, so for the digipack, sorry, this isn't a digipack, this is a platform version, and I've left a spot. I don't, I won't be getting the digipacks just because they're, I'm not doing member, <laughs> member specific digipacks um, for groups where I collect more than one member. Oh, yeah. Um, so yeah, but they did do digipacks and they had, what's it called? They did do digipacks, but they only had six, whereas literally every other version of the album has nine, um, at least for how I'm collecting them. So to just complete the nine pattern, I am putting uh, a pop here and it works out because I pull these two, um, where are they from? They're from Soundwave. Um, the cute little donut ones 
um so i ordered from kpopalbum.com not sponsored it's just where i go um, and they were like have a pop like you could order them with pops so i did and i pulled two of my bias line which was great so here we go so that is it so far for beautiful shadow like this is where i will be like focusing on um i have pos i have a trade coming but it's coming from australia so that's a bit stressy um what we will do before we do anything else is put these two here because look i am a weakling um and i saw someone selling i like i saw both of these on our photo cards for like two quid each um and i had to get them because one day i will collect ishan and mk <laughs> in full uh and if i can find like if i find super cheap things just to get a little head start i'll do that um so yeah that's that's it um we're not talking about it that that's for like future me um however here we have um we have like <laughs> three of these to put away so we have um these came with um these came with the what's it called they came with the um city of on and off photo cards i bought because i bought them like in sets so these are from city on and off and then this is oh my gosh they just fell from the Zidro content, which is oh, it's my favorite thing. So I need to get a new page, but I don't want to. Nah, no, screw it, I will, I will. Okay, dokey, let's just put this in. So, let's see. So spin off is first, excuse me. I know there was probably like a quicker way of doing this, but I'm not that small. <laughs> and then we have the City of On and Off ones, because that's also City of On and Off, or it's Goosebumps, I think it's Goosebumps. This is so, this is, this, this I am very weak to white in tank tops i will not lie to you yeah i think this is i know this is seat of one and off but then this is goosebumps okay so we have like a full thing of like seat of one and off that's great then goosebumps you've seen these before uh then Of these two. Which are from Love Effect. I don't want to this one here. And the bunny. Bunny wire. And then we can just take these out for now. I'll put fills in at a later date. I cannot be bothered right now. And then this Zidro one can go there on its own. Oh, what the door? Yeah, I think someone just posted something through. All right, so that is it for on and off. Now, oh no, it's not it for on and off. That's my bad. I completely forgot. Uh, we have these dive into on and off photo cards to put away. So uh, I did get the dive into on and off like box set thing, um, because. This has absolutely been one of my I'm sad, I need to watch something set, like um video series, reality series. Um, so I just I had to get the box set for it. Um and I'm so glad I did. <laughs> um, but it came with this like full member set, so this will just go at the back because if it's not at the back and I see it more than I sort of like have to uh, I will want to collect full group and I can't afford that so there we go these five cards are so cute 
I really want to dive into on and off shirt but alas um so yes that is it for that is actually it for on and off it's it's such a cute set it's such a cute set um so now we can move on to we i okay we've got so much for we i <laughs> we have so much so far so uh we have these and then all of this so first of all we will put away the love part two stuff uh, so where are we where are we uh yes so we have they're both white backs so they both go here um i think it's like i don't know what i think it's like <laughs> um yes we have these two and now we're only missing like one more for this uh for love part two which is very fun I think one of my goals this year is to get at least like love part one and part two completed because I literally only need like what one two for first love and then one for um love passion so I, th I, I think that's doable I think that's doable <laughs> uh then did I not set up for it I did, I did. Okay, so for their latest Japanese album, Wave, there are 10 photo cards. So, did I set them up correctly? Okay, so we have the black backs, the white backs, and the red backs. And for this, I'm gonna sort of pick the, I'm gonna put, right, I'm gonna put the red and black backs in first because the white backs are a like combination of these like um theme concept wise so i think we'll have the red here so let's see how okay so they have the hand in these two like that so that looks very cute um i am complete with uh, wave which is very exciting. Um, they're currently in Japan still. Um, Sokwa's actually like really hurt his wrist. Um, so he's in a brace. Still performing and stuff, but I, I just I hope he's um I hope he's resting, bless him. Like enough. <laughs> he was like, yeah, the doctor cleared me, and I was like, Diddy though. Diddy. But if he wants to perform, he can't stop him from performing. Uh, Johan is still not with them. He is living, like, his best MC life, doing everything. But I really, I really hope that we get, like, an OT6 comeback soon. Um, well, first of all, I hope they have a rest first. <laughs> I hope they have a rest first. Um, and then, like, have an OT6 comeback. Uh, so, let's see. So, these two have stuff so i think maybe because these have the hands still but then this one like doesn't okay maybe if i hmm because two have a hand two don't maybe if i is there any hmm Hmm. Because it has to be like maybe these two and then this one can go on its own. Hmm. Okay, yep, yeah, decided. That'll that'll just have to work. <laughs> <sighs> Unless I do it like white, red. No, that, what am I thinking? No. These are also cute. Here we go. Ooh. And then this one can go here. And then it's sort of like, it sort of matches because they're doing cute little, um, 
cute little faces. Like these two sort of match because they're doing cute little faces. There we go. And then we have some more Sequoia, just like non-album, non-album stuff to put away. Uh, oh, cute. oh my gosh, there's four. Uh, I need, I need another. Didn't think this through. Why am I like this? Okay, give me a second. There's me like, oh, I definitely set up for all of this. No, I fucking didn't. <laughs> no, I fucking didn't. Uh, okay, so. These were all last year. And then this is from their season's greetings. Um, it just came as like a freebie when I like bought some other Sukwa cards. Um, so that's very cute. Honestly, that means I won't be tempted to just sort of wreck on myself and buy the season's greetings because I'm oh, do you know the amount of times I've looked at like specifically Golden Child on and off and we guys season's greetings. <laughs> I will never buy more than one season's greetings a year. It will always be in flying, but like I'm tempted. Um and then this is before the latest album. Um this is actually from the content him and uh, Junso and Dayon did Dahyon Dayon Dahyon Dayon Dayon um did um they like cooked but Jang Jun was the MC for it and when I saw photo cards I was like oh my gosh I need them because it was from content they did with Jang Jun that's like alt crossover <laughs> so yeah and then these are from this era I had to get this one because it's literally uh duck core it's duck core he's in a blankie uh, he has a hot pack, uh, he's covered in a yellow blankie, and he has oranges and tangerines when that's like my representative fruit because I'm orange. So <laughs> I had to get it. Um, and then we just have this, which is so fun. I like, I, what is it? That? Oh my gosh, I'm that. It looks so weird from like this way rather than like the other way. But yeah, there we go. So. That's it for their last pair. There we go. Then we can move on. We have like some extra <laughs> cards because I can't get rid of them. Um, do we not have any? Yeah, we do have a spare day on thing. So yeah, I, I couldn't trade these away. <laughs> like, what are you asking of me? Couldn't do it. Um, same with this one what are you asking me couldn't do it <laughs> uh, we do have a Junso though that I also just couldn't he's absolutely common for me lately is Junso like I can't cope <laughs> I can't cope um, we have oh my gosh I need another page what goes on okay I did not think this through like at all. What is wrong with me? So I think what we'll do is just put this one first. This is from the content with Jan June. Then here we can have, where have I put it? There we go. The page. And then we just have these two from this era. Very, very cute. This one especially is so cute. I adore unit and group cards. Like, give me all of them all of the time. I think, yeah, the backs don't fucking matter here. I can put them in like, like I want, which is to face that way. <laughs> the backs don't matter on these pages at all. They can be upside down. It doesn't, it, do it doesn't matter. There we go. And then that means I can put this. Oh yeah, I, I have put that one in. Okay. And then we go to the back to put away this one junk suit card because I I couldn't I couldn't I couldn't get rid of it. I couldn't get rid of it. But that is it. That is it. So let's go to like a cute little page. Let's go to a cute little Sokwa page. There we go. 
so uh that is it for this video um again i'm sorry it was late um and i'm sorry the videos will be a bit more sporadic in the future but i am here i am still filming i am still doing stuff it's just i'm not spending as much money on k-pop anymore so that will obviously affect what i film because i'll just have less to film um but that's okay that's <laughs> it's called being responsible and i hate it but i'll do it so that is it um thank you so much for watching i hope you have a good day and i'll see you in the next one bye